what we have here are some bonnet lettering. When I started this project I was quite inspired by um, Twisted Performance, uh, they develop Range Rovers and also Khan, and I quite like the idea of personalising the front of it in a similar kind of style but using uh, the word 4-track. So I found some nice uh, fonts, uh, 3D lettering on the internet. Now it's not actually going to sit on top there, it's going to sit sit on this inclined part here, but I'm going to have to mark it out properly so I know where the lettering is. But uh, it gives you an idea of what it looked like on the bonnet. So it's not going to sit at the top there, it's going to sit below on that incline, in the same way place where it sits on the on the, on the Defender. Uh, Charles Black, I think that's going to work really well. In addition to that, just to give you a walk around and an indication, hoping to have two black mini style uh, stripes on the bonnet with uh, brushed aluminium edging uh, and then moving around I'm hoping to have a black, a gloss black uh, roof with uh, brushed aluminium edging right around the outsides with a brushed aluminium uh, wing mirror so that should really give it quite a nice modern look uh, the side steps which we're going to take out again to show you in context uh, a black and brushed aluminium look on the on the sides and we have some black and brushed aluminium wheels which which should arrive within the next few weeks so really starting to look starting to take shape i think i want to work on the aesthetics how it looks on the outside and i'm going to take it back to At atkinson automotives to get them to just tune up the engine and get and then looking to put the interior back together and we'll go to a leather specialist for that but these this type this font looks amazing it really does. i'll give you a close-up what I'll also do is, when I post this, post a link to where you can get this particular font on the internet. They're relatively expensive, uh, inexpensive. Um, so, yeah. Really, 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 really nice. Works really well. And they're a nice, solid, chunky, uh, pewter metal. You know, it's not like a plastic. It's, like, it's quite hardy. So once that's stuck on, that should look quite good. Alright, so that's what our bonnet's going to look like. Just remind you, it's going to go on this part, lower back here, not on the top part, but I'm just laying it out there so we can get an idea what it looks like.